Asghar Ali Engineer, the 10th of March 1939 to the 14th of May 2013, was an Indian reformist writer and social activist. Internationally known for his work on liberation theology in Islam, he led the progressive Dawoodi Bohra movement. The focus of his work was on communalism and communal and ethnic violence in India and South Asia. He was a votary of peace and non-violence and lectured all over world on communal harmony. Engineer also served as head of the Institute of Islamic Studies and the Center for Study of Society and Secularism, both of which he founded in 1980 and 1993 respectively. He also made contributions to the God Contention, a website comparing and contrasting various worldviews. Engineer's autobiography A Living Faith, My Quest for Peace, Harmony and Social Change was released in New Delhi on 20 July 2011 by Hamid Ansari, the then Vice President of India. Biography <inaudible> 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 Asghar Ali Engineer was born 10 March 1939 in Salambar, Rajasthan, India as son of a Bora priest, Sheikh Kurban Hussain. He was trained in Quranic tafsir commentary, tawil hidden meaning of Quran, fiqh jurisprudence and hadith prophet sayings, and learned the Arabic language. He graduated with a degree in civil engineering from Vikram University in Ujjain, Madhya Pradesh, and served for 20 years as an engineer in the Bombay Municipal Corporation before taking voluntary retirement in 1972, to devote himself to the Bora reform movement. He began to play a leading role in the reform movement in 1972 when a revolt took place in Udaipur. He was unanimously elected as General Secretary of the Central Board of Dawoodi Bora Community in its first conference in Udaipur in 1977. In 2004 due to criticism of the Dawoodi Bora religious establishment he was expelled. In 1980, he set up the Institute of Islamic Studies in Mumbai to create a platform for progressive Muslims in India and elsewhere. Subsequently, through the 1980s, he wrote extensively on Hindu-Muslim relations, and growing communal violence in India. Asghar Ali Engineer has been instrumental in publicizing the progressive Dawoodi Bora movement through his writings and speeches. In 1993, he founded Center for Study of Society and Secularism to promote communal harmony. He supported the ban on Salman Rushdie's satanic verses because he felt that the novel is an attack on religion. He authored more than 50 books and many articles in various national and international journals. He was the founding chairman of the Asian Muslim Action Network, director of the Institute of Islamic Studies, and head of the Center for Study of Society and Secularism in Mumbai, where he closely worked with scholar and scientist Professor Dr. Ram Puniyani. Engineer was also a supporter of the supporter of the campaign for the establishment of a United Nations Parliamentary Assembly, an organization which campaigns for democratic reformation of the United Nations. <laughs> <laughs> Beliefs on women's rights Engineer wrote that Women do not enjoy the status the Quran has given them in Muslim society today. Engineer believed that in this day and age women should be equal to men. Women had internalized their subjugation of men as the latter were the breadwinners. Since then women have become quite conscious of their new status. Engineer believed that women should be treated as equal to men, and said that people who support an unjust order, or remain silent in view of gross injustices were not religious people. Women's inequality topped his priority list of injustices. However, critics said that his interpretations of the Quran were not strong enough to get people to change their beliefs surrounding women's place in Islam. 
Sakan thought that engineer's opinion was based on his interpretation of the Quran and his outlook on the 21st century instead of the interpretations that the Quran has now. His understanding of Islam is indelibly shaped by his concern for social justice and inter-communal harmony, of course. Topic Awards Engineer was given several awards during his lifetime, including the Dalmia Award for Communal Harmony in 1990, an honorary D. Lit. by the University of Calcutta in 1993, the Communal Harmony Award in 1997 and the Right Livelihood Award in 2004 with Swami Agnivesh for his strong commitment to promote values of coexistence and tolerance topic <laughs> some works origin and development of islam an essay on its socio-economic growth by asgar ali engineer asgar ali engineer staff Published by South Asia Books, 1980. ISBN 0-8364-0590-0. The Islamic State. Published by Vickers, 1980. ISBN 0-7069-1086-9. Sufism and Communal Harmony Islam and its relevance to our age. Published by Institute of Islamic Studies, 1984. On Developing Theory of Communal Riots. Published by Institute of Islamic Studies, 1984. Islam and Revolution. Published by Ajanta Publications, 1984. Islam and Muslims, A Critical Reassessment. Published by Printwell Publishers, 1985. Islam in South and Southeast Asia. Published by Ajanta Publications, 1985. ISBN 81-202-0152-3. Indian Muslims, A Study of Minority Problems in India. Published by Ajanta Publications, India, 1985. Communalism in India, by Asghar Ali Engineer, Moin Shakir. Published by Ajanta Publications, India, 1985. ISBN 81-202-0153-1. The Role of Minorities in Freedom Struggle. Institute of Islamic Studies, Bombay, India. Published by Ajanta Publications, 1986. Ethnic Conflict in South Asia. Published by Ajanta Publications, 1987. Status of Women in Islam. Published by Ajanta Publications, India, 1987. ISBN 81-202-0190-6. The Shah Bano Controversy, Orient Longman, 1987. ISBN 0-86131-701-7. The Muslim Communities of Gujarat, an exploratory study of Bohras, Kojas, and Memons, published by Ajanta Publications, 1989. ISBN 81-202-0220-1. Religion and Liberation. Published by Ajanta Publications, India, 1989. ISBN 81-202-0264-3. Communalism and Communal Violence in India, An Analytical Approach to Hindu-Muslim Conflict. Published by Ajanta Publications, India, 1989. Communal Riots in Post-Independence India. Published by Orient Black Swan, 1991. ISBN 81-7370-102-4. Secular Crown on Fire, The Kashmir Problem. Published by Ajanta Publications, 1991. ISBN 81-202-0311-9. Mandal Commission Controversy. 
Published by Ajanta Publications, 1991. ISBN 81-202-0312-7. Rights of Women in Islam. Sterling Publishers, 1992. Communalization of Politics and Tenth Lok Sabha Elections, by Asghar Ali Engineer, Pradeep Nayak. Published by Ajanta Publications, 1993. The Boras. South Asia Books, 1994. ISBN 0-7069-7345-3. Kerala Muslims, A Historical Perspective. Published by Ajanta Publications, 1995. Lifting the Veil, Communal Violence and Communal Harmony in Contemporary India. Sangam Books, 1995. ISBN 81-7370-040-0. Problems of Muslim Women in India. Published by Institute of Islamic Studies, 1995. Rethinking Issues in Islam. Sangam Books Limited, 1998. ISBN 0-86311-768-6. Competing Nationalisms in South Asia, Essays for Asghar Ali Engineer, by Paul R. Brass, Akin Van Eyck, Asghar Ali Engineer. Published by Orient Blackswan, 2002. ISBN 81-252-221-X Islam in India, The Impact of Civilizations. Shipra Publications, 2002. ISBN 81-7541-115-5 The Gujarat Carnage. Orient Longman, 2003 ISBN 978-81-250-2496-5 The Qur'an, Women, and Modern Society. Published by New Dawn Press Group, 2005. ISBN 1-932705-42-2. The State in Islam, Nature and Scope. Hope India Publications, 2006. ISBN 81-7871-102-8. Islam in Contemporary World. Sterling Publishers, 2007. ISBN 1-932705-69-4. Islam in Postmodern World. Hope India Publications, 2009. Topic. Further reading Islam in Democracy Dr. Asghar Ali Engineers Articles Rutgers University Madrasa Education Myth and Reality TCN News <laughs>